I'm Volusia County Sheriff uh, Mike Chipwood, and I thought it was important that we take the time today to let all the community in Volusia County know who are worried about these horses, that they are being well taken care of. We're in a confidential location with a confidential veterinarian. Uh, the horses are suffering from malnutrition, dehydration, and a heart murmur. Uh, and right now, according to the vet, the next seven to ten days are going to be extremely important as uh, they are put on a diet to try to, to, quite frankly, fatten them up and rehydrate them. Uh, I can assure everyone that they are getting the greatest of care. They are being loved. And the vet had told us that in her 20 plus years of being a veterinarian, this was the worst case of malnutrition and dehydration that the vet had ever seen. Both of these horses are females, go by the name of uh, Tiffany and, uh, what was the other one? Niagara. Niagara. Mm -hmm. uh, this is Tiffany, this is Niagara. As you can see, they are absolutely beautiful animals. Yeah, we have the sheriff here. We're just glad that the, the people in the community alerted us and we were able to do something before it was too late. Uh, but the vet did tell us this is a very critical period of time. Uh, for these horses in the next seven to ten days are going to be extremely important to see how they react to their, their treatment uh, as they try to uh, you know, get, their, get their diet back up, get their weight back up. So, again, we're grateful to everyone who keeps asking about the care of the horses. And like I said, I can tell you we're at a confidential location. They have a great medical care and they're being loved. And, you know, Hopefully the good Lord will allow these animals to survive. And the other thing law enforcement wise is we're waiting for the vet's report in the next seven to 10 days before we can uh, press charges. Uh, right now, verbally, the owner of the horses has signed the horses over to the sheriff's office. Um, so he's given up custody of them. And hopefully uh, they'll find a loving place for the remainder of their lives.